And good morning, this is Natalie with Discover Real Estate. I am in Pacific Marlin at a house that we're listing for sale. And I just wanna do a video of it while I'm here. It is magnificent views, look at this. You see all the way north to Madeiras over there. So just incredible views, it's a little hazy, but you've got great ocean views here. You've got more ocean view over here. So you're on the backside of Jesus. So you've got a view of the Nakaskola Bay, but it's like a full-on view, which is amazing. The, the house is positioned perfectly to capture the views. Um, right now I'm upstairs. There's a nice uh, patio up here. The master bedroom is just right here off to the left. So, but you've got a nice big patio upstairs. There's three bedrooms up here. That bedroom has direct access and the master bedroom has direct access to the patio. The sliding glass doors here are amazing. These, they, they, they close completely. So let me just show you this. And then that whole thing just slides open. But one of the cool things in this room is the TV. It actually is, has a motor, so it goes up. So this goes up flat against the ceiling, so it's out of the way, which is a really cool, cool feature. So here is the master bedroom and they have the blackout shades for the windows and stuff. But you've got a king size bed in here. This is the walk-in closet. So there's great closet space in this house, not just in the master bedroom, but in all the bedrooms except for one. Well, no, it has, it has closets. It just doesn't have the walk-in closet, so. Um, and then here is the master bathroom. The sink, this is elevated, which is really nice. Good morning. So, so you've got a nice shower. I love the shower head, Steve and Angela, because you can move it around and position it exactly where you want. You've got a nice shelf in the shower. And then the toilet has its own little room with windows and screens on the windows. All the windows and doors in this house are just super good quality. Look at these seams. Um, these are good vinyl windows. In the, bed, in the bathrooms for privacy, they have them frosted. So that's a nice feature. But yeah, this TV, that's just really cool. I've not seen that before. So, And then also upstairs, you have a second living room. So you've got a little TV room here. And also they, rather than this just being open, they glass this that goes down the staircase. Um, so this can be closed off so that way you can keep something cool if you're air conditioning this at night. So that's important because there is an air conditioner here. So you can close that door and have this room air conditioned and not a problem. Now here is the other bedroom. On the other side of the blackout screens is sliding glass doors that go out to the patio. Got a nice bathroom in here. So once again, you have the frosted glass and the cool shower head. And it, this bedroom also has its own walk-in closet. The house is also built incredibly strong. Um, for all for earthquake standards because he lived through the earthquake here in 72 as a child He got stuck in the house in Managua and so now he made, when he built his own house here in San Juan He made sure that nothing was going to happen with this house. It, it's got amazing footers and deep pilings and So it's a very very strong very secure house This is what they call like the, the grandkids room. Um, and another little feature I want to show you that they do, he puts charcoal in the drawers because they don't rent this house out. And, and so they come down every now and then. So they got charcoal back there. So there's charcoal inside of all of these cabinets and stuff to absorb moisture and odors. So it keeps the house fresher by having that charcoal in the drawers and doors. So. Okay, let me take you down. The, um, they've got the windows that can open here in the staircase. So if you want some more ventilation. And there's also great parking. Um, so I'll show you that too. 
we'll come down here. But this is amazing. So both sides, there's a column and like both sides of the wall open up completely. So you've got this fantastic view from your living room out onto the patio. You got a little bar area there, you can sit. And my favorite feature is these built-in lounge chairs. That is cool, because I'm a big reader, so I would sit there and read. <laughs> and so they got a hammock stand here. Also, this window is a pass-through window, so if they're in the kitchen cooking, they can slide the screens open and pass food out. This is a barbecue area that was designed by an Argentinian because they love to the barbecue. And check out this tray. You just pop that tray out with the, the ashes and clean it and then put it right back in. So it's a fabulous feature. And now this lot is big. It goes all the way to the wall up there. So, and then it goes down below here. You see the, the retaining walls that's all the property too and it goes down to a point so and it's accessible from the other side there's another lower parking area on the other side um so there's tons of parking for this house let me give you a view of it here and it's the kitchen in the front and then there's a guest bedroom over on that side let me take you in and show you the kitchen Big closet that goes under the stairs. So you got lots of storage space in this house if you wanted to. And you've got the charcoal back there absorbing all the odors and the moisture. So um, lots of closets you can lock off if you you know want to rent the house out and stuff. So nice, nice windows in the kitchen. Lots of cabinets, and they've got the tile baseboard, which is nice. This is a huge closet here, which is nice, and it goes back in. So you've got tons of storage space in here. And then off of the kitchen is the maid's room, but it's a nice area. You could easily use this as another bedroom for a kid. Um, so it's got the bed and it's got closet space. And then here you have a washer and dryer and a door to the outside. And then here is the full bathroom for the maid's room. So very nice space. And there's also a caretaker residence here. So the, the maid's room is, was built, you know, for the typical Nicaraguans if they're traveling, they bring their maid, their nanny, their driver. So that was designed for, for that. Um, but it could be used as another bedroom for somebody. And then there is a bedroom on the first floor, a regular bedroom with its own in-suite bathroom. Um, so if you have somebody elderly and that's got nice windows but they have the blackout shades drawn. So a lot of the beds have never been used. This house was built in 2017. Um, hello. And they've only used it maybe a total of about three months. <laughs> so it's uh, very gently used and mostly just by the gentleman. His wife is allergic to the sun, so she doesn't come very often. Um, but yeah. And then here, this is the blue is the front door. And then you have a half a bath here right off of the entrance. And so, okay. Take you outside and show you this out here. So you've got a little bit of a covered parking area here. He will consider selling the truck with the house. So that is an option. And then it has a garage, and then the caretaker residence is above the garage. But look at how big this parking space is. You've got tons of space here. And you also have more parking below. So let me show you this. You've got steps that go down, and you've another gate here, and more parking here. 
and then to get to the lot that's below the pool area you just go around this way so you you would have another driving access if you wanted to build something on that lower lot you could easily do that um, or just keep it as a play area for kids or whatever so let me show you the garage space and he also there's a polaris there also that he will consider selling with the property it comes with a generator that's propane so here's the garage so we got a nice big space here in the garage and a closet under the stairs and then here's all the electric panels and the generator panel And then this is the propane tanks and the water filters. So this is the propane tanks for the generator. And this goes into the laundry room space. So come on into the kitchen. And then you can walk all the way around the house. You've got these nice retaining walls. Um, you have a concrete laundry sink and a mop sink here. You've got an on-demand hot water heater that's gas powered. So these sinks are fantastic. If you've been fishing or something, clean your fish out here, not in the kitchen. These are the water tank or the gas tanks for the kitchen stove and the hot water heater. So you have the pool pump here. And then we're back at the front again. Here's the caretaker. <laughs> so, but yeah, this is just a beautiful, beautiful property. And another feature I really like about it is part of the pool has a roof over it. So, so that stays shaded. So you can be in the pool, you know, at two o'clock in the afternoon and have shade and not be burning yourself. So, but these built-in lounge chairs, that's my favorite thing right here. So, but yeah, just a beautiful house, amazing views. I love this view. Look at these. Sit up here and watch the waves bouncing off the rocks. It's a pretty calm day today, so not many big waves, but uh, I'm sure during some storms, those, those waves are bouncing off those rocks out there, and they're just beautiful. So. Fantastic house, great view, positioned perfectly on the lot, built for, for earth, to withstand any earthquake, so, and lots of space, extra space below the lot here, so that's just real important, having that extra space down there, so absolutely incredible. I love my life. Come join me.